Hello everyone. In today's video, we will study the cloud computing topic. We will study the different platform and types of cloud computing. So let's get started. So the question number one in today's video is that which which of the following answers refers to a cloud computing delivery model in which the cloud infrastructure is provisioned for open use by the general public? And the options are hybrid cloud, private cloud community cloud and the public cloud and the correct option is the public cloud so the public cloud is uh, usually available and accessible to all the general public and they can access uh, it using the internet for example the aws amazon web services is an example of a uh, public cloud where anyone can access the uh, this cloud using the Amazon subscription services. Question number two is that a type of cloud infrastructure available solely for a single organization is known as, and again the options are public cloud, community cloud, hybrid cloud, or private cloud. Uh, and the correct option is the private cloud. So the private cloud is dedicated for a single organization uh, as opposed to the general public where anyone can access it the private cloud is deployed and is used by a single entity question number three is that a cloud delivery model consisting of two or more interlinked cloud infrastructures such as private community or public is referred to as a hybrid cloud and the uh, we have two options whether the statement is true or false and the correct option is true yes the statement is true so uh, in this type of in the hybrid cloud let's suppose we have a public cloud and a private cloud let's suppose an organization has both the private cloud and the public cloud so this combination of private and public cloud is known as the hybrid cloud uh, the organization uses both the public and uh, private cloud some services let's suppose their most uh, secret or sensitive data they can be they are stored inside the private cloud while the publicly available or the uh, non-sensitive data it is stored on the public cloud and the organization uses both the services as per their requirements question number four is that a cloud computing service model offering remote access to applications based on monthly or annual subscri uh, subscription fee is called and the options are pass or plot platform as a service SaaS or software as a service iaas or infrastructure as a service and daas daas stands for desktop as a service and the correct option is software as a service so when you uh, only access the application using the cloud then this uh, platform or this service model is known as software as a service question number five is that which cloud service model would provide the best solution for a web developer intending to create a web app and the options are again DOS, SOS, POS and IAAS and the correct option is POS or platform as a service so in platform as a service you have the infrastructure you have the hardware the storage and the operating system and so the developer can use this infrastructure to create his own apps using this platform the complete app platform using the hardware and the vms and os is available to him and he can use this platform to create his own apps which of the following answer refers to a cloud-based VDI service? And the options are IAAS, 
फॉस डॉस और सॉस एंड द करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज डॉस और डेस्कटॉप एज अ सर्विस डॉस स्टैंड फॉर डेस्कटॉप एज अ सर्विस एंड द वीडियो स्टैंड फॉर वर्चुअल virtual desktop infrastructure so you can relate that the platform providing desktop services that is used by vdi or virtual desktop infrastructure question number 7 is that a devops practice that replaces manual configuration of hardware with automatic deployment to code is called and the options are iac virtualization pos or vdi and the correct option is iac or infrastructure as a code infrastructure as a code so again the words code you uh, from the word code you can relate that the correct platform that is used by the devops devops practice is iac or infrastructure as a code question number 80 that examples of cloud connectivity option include virtual private network vpn connections and private direct connections to cloud provider and we have two option whether the statement is true or false and yes the statement is true you can connect to the cloud provider using vpn or to a private direct connection question number 9 is that in cloud computing the practice of grouping together computing resources and making them available for shared access for multiple consuming consumers is referred to as and the options are broad network access mired service on demand self service or resource pooling and the correct option is resource pooling so in resource pooling you pool the resources and make it available to multiple consumers question number 10 is that which of the following terms refer to a cloud computing feature that allows for automatic allocation of computing resources in proportion with the demand and the options are rapid elasticity mired service on demand self service or resource pooling again the correct option is rapid elasticity question number 11 is that which of the terms listed below refers to a cloud computing feature that allows consumer to control the volume and type of utilized computing resources and the options are mired service on demand self service broad network access or rapid elasticity and the correct option is on demand self service so that's all for today if you like the video so please subscribe and stay tuned and support this channel thank you